This may be the most recognized, talked about, and photographed place in Woodford County, the castle. For years, the desolate fort on a knoll sat empty, shrouded in mystery, until Lexington native Tom Post bought the decaying structure in 2003. He rebuilt it after someone set it on fire and opened its gargantuan doors to the public this past spring as Castle Post. You can book a suite in one of the turrets for $1,500 a night. The castle's available for meetings, parties, weddings, and charity fundraisers. The county boasts the largest total farm income in Kentucky, largely due to the horse industry. You'll find some of the most beautiful, successful, and well-known horse farms in the world here. Versailles is the county seat, named to honor General Lafayette. Hollywood has taken notice of this town. Most of the small town scenes in the movie Elizabethtown were shot here. It was also the setting of the movie Dreamer. You can take a trip back in time at the Bluegrass Railroad Museum in Woodford County Park in Versailles. The museum offers a seven-mile, one-hour round-trip train excursion through the breathtaking horse farms. You'll see actual stones from the first railroad built in Kentucky in 1831, among other things. Speaking of history, there is plenty here at Weisenberger Mills. Six generations of Weisenbergers have operated the mill at the present location since 1865, making it the oldest continuously operating mill in Kentucky. In the early years, they primarily produced soft wheat flour and white cornmeal. Today, they offer more than 70 items. In the northern part of the county, you'll find the city of Midway. It got its name because it's midway between Lexington and Frankfort, and midway between Versailles and Georgetown. This was Kentucky's first railroad town. The quaint downtown with its antique shops and restaurants underwent a major renovation six years ago, and it still wears it well. Many of the homes and businesses here are listed on the National Register of Historic Places. Oh, here's some Midway trivia. Zeralda James, mother of Frank and Jesse James, was born here in the Black Horse Inn. She lived there with her father, who ran the tavern. The county is also home to Woodford Reserve, the oldest bourbon distillery in the state, dating back to 1812.